You are watching JMC's Corner. <laughs> Hi guys! Welcome to JNC's Kitchen and today we're going to cook a spaghetti with zucchini noodles. So what are our ingredients for this uh, recipe? We got 16 oz beef ground free-range or grass-fed organic. Um, actually, it's entirely up to you with how much you're going to cook. So, but as a as a guide, you can use the 16 oz beef. You got a tomato sauce organic, one zucchini fresh organic, 14 oz cheese any type raw and organic. So we have an op optional ingredients. Uh, mushrooms. Um, it's entirely up to you if how much you're going to add into your recipe. Two cloves of garlic and one medium size onion. So we will be needing uh, sea salt, black pepper, and olive virgin oil. So in a saucepan, we have to put the meat. And add about one fourth cup of water. So just put your stove into a, like a medium to high heat and cover until it boils. Once it started to boil, just try to spread the meat evenly so that it will cook um, properly. So let it simmer for several minutes um, and keep stirring it in order to have an even cook in the meat. Wait until the, um, the meat is golden brown and all the uh, water has been absorbed. So once the water has been absorbed, just make sure to lower down the heat. And keep stirring it so that it will not get burned. So once our beef is dry, we're going to saute our onions and garlic. So first we have to put the olive oil and when our garlic is golden brown we can add our onions And when, an or, when, and when our onion is getting separated and transparent, we can mix them all together. Also, you can season it with pepper and salt. And when it's all mixed properly, just add your mushrooms. Just uh, add a little bit of water just to simmer your mushroom. and cover it up until it cooks. Just stir it from time to time just to make sure um, the bottom part will not get burned. So 
once the mushroom is also cooked, uh, we can add our tomato sauce. to stir it um, evenly so that all the sauce uh, will be spread. Wait until it simmer and so close while waiting it to simmer. So once it's simmering you can adjust the taste of your sauce. You can add more salt if you want. If you reach the right taste of your sauce, all you need to do is turn off your uh, heat and set the sauce aside. So using a food processor, I have um, shred the zucchini and it looks like this um, so this one I have uh, blanched the zucchini if you don't you can use either fresh or blanched zucchini uh, to make it like the pasta of your spaghetti so now let's put our sauce and spread the cheese on the top. And here is our finished product. So I can't wait to, to try it. We'll see how it tastes. It's lovely, it's very nice. All I can say is make sure um, your zucchini is well drained because sometimes uh, there's still water like I have some here there's still some water so but still it stays very nice and refreshing and I really recommend to try it and also I will try also the fresh one in a minute so in here I got a uh, fresh zucchini and let's put the sauce on the top of it Let's put the cheese on the top. So let's try the fresh zucchini. Guys, it's lovely. I think the fresh zucchini is is better compared to the blanche one. But individually, it's entirely up to you. So I would recommend this recipe and it's really nutritious and it's yummy. So I hope guys you keep an eye on our next video, our next nutritious recipe and give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Thanks very much. See you next time. Bye.